What's up, mi gente? Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new to my channel, my name is Leslie. Welcome. Please don't forget to subscribe if you enjoy this video. I would love to have you become part of my YouTube family. And today's video is going to be all about storing breast milk. As you guys know, I am a working mom, so I do have to pump my milk and store it so that Eden can have milk for the next day. I bet, you know, if you're a first time mom, you're wondering, you know, how to store your breast milk, how long to store it, where to store it. So hopefully I can answer those questions for you today. So when you freshly, I'll also have a link below where I got this information from. This is the information I was given when I had eaten. For freshly expressed milk, it can be stored four to six hours at room temperature, five days or less in the refrigerator. Sorry if you hear noise. Eden's right there. It can be stored in the freezer ideally for three months or in a deep freezer for 12 months or less. I don't have a deep freezer, I have a regular freezer. So mine can only be stored for three months in there. If you previously have frozen breast milk, in order to thaw it out, you put the baggie of breast milk in some hot water. Um, and it usually, breast milk thaws out like quickly, very quickly. Um, but if you have previously frozen it and it's thawed out, it can be at room temperature for four hours or less, or it can be in the refrigerator for 24 hours or less. Um, but you cannot refreeze frozen milk that you thawed out. It cannot be refrozen. You have to use it that same day, pretty much. Once your child starts drinking from that previously frozen milk i was told that they should drink it within an hour from that or else it's not good anymore because of bacteria and whatnot so that's what i was told not sure how accurate that is um so to store breast milk you're gonna need some breast milk baggies um i really like the nuke brand yeah yeah, I really like the new brand. That was my favorite one. That one seems very... Hold on. What happened, mama? I really like the new brand of the milk storage bags because they're good quality. They're thicker. They're just really nicer. This is... But they are more pricey. This is the Up and Up brand. So it's the Target brand. And... Let me see if I can get it to focus. Um, let me see. You can write the date, your child's name in case they go to daycare. You can write the time and how much is in there. So the amount or the volume. It says volume. And the bag holds up to six ounces of breast milk and it says do not fill above those six ounces. Now, I would suggest don't go off of the measurements of this. The bags are not accurate when it comes to the measurements. Go based off of a bottle because the bottle is going to be more accurate. So let's say I noticed the very first time that I pumped, like when my milk first came in two days after I gave birth, I noticed that three ounces or one ounce in the bottle was about two ounces on here something like that i can't remember exactly but i did ask the lactation consultant about it and she did say that the bottles are more accurate than this so go based off of your bottle not this because you'll also notice if you put in a bottle six ounces and you transfer it to here it's gonna be above the six ounces um so yeah in this bag, particularly, you rip off the top and you put it in, you you close it and you put it in the freezer. I would suggest laying them flat to freeze because if not, they're going to be all, dip, all like a weird shape and it'll be hard to like keep them nicely 
organized in your fridge i mean in your freezer i would say organize them by dates you know your latest early um your most recent dates in the back and your oldest dates in the front because you want to be using up your milk within those three months so that's what i would suggest that's what i do um but another thing is let's say you're you're um pumping one day and then giving it for your child if your child goes to daycare or if someone else takes care of your child for the next day i found these containers these are the philip advent um store breast milk securely oh these are the philip advent reusable breast milk storage cups and i really like these these came in handy because bags can get expensive um it does say you can freeze these but when you freeze these um when you freeze these they're kind of it takes longer for them both to defrost because these are plastic but um they come with 10 reusable ones and they also come with these converters so what you do with these converters is um if you have like a philip admin um bottle top you put it on top and it converts into a bottle and you can feed them i don't have one so i've never used it but i think that is pretty cool so this is how the cup looks let me see if I can zoom in for you to see better. So this is how the cup looks. It goes up to 6 ounces. And it has UK fluid ounces and United States fluid ounces on this side. So it goes up to 6 ounces. It also has a spot where you can put a label or you can... Can you see that? You can write your child's name and the date that you pumped it um also on the lid oh, that's gonna be so hard to see i don't think you'll be able to see it but on the lid it has a spot for your child's name um date time and how many ounces are in here and it says you can use a pencil and it It says you can use a pencil and write it in and erase and reuse and whatnot. I personally didn't need to do that. But um, I think these are really good. They, I think they're like 12 bucks for the 10. Um, but it saves you more money than these. They're like $15 for 100 of them. And that may seem like a lot, but it really isn't when you're pumping. I would go through 100 maybe in like two weeks two three weeks so these really do save you money and i love these i vouch for these so the way i would use these is that i would pump and then i would store my milk i would I would store my milk in these and then i would use them for the next day but on fridays when i would pump i would put that milk in the freezer so that it can be thawed out on monday for her to eat but those that i would thaw out put on friday for the freezer i would use the, i would use the bags i started using these but um eden's caretaker was complaining that it was hard to defrost so on fridays i will put friday's milk in here so that it could be used for monday and be easier to thaw out um another trick sometimes um when you're thawing out these bags um they can kind of leak especially if you have more than six ounces in here they can leak so you can put it inside a ziploc bag and put that to defrost that way if it does leak you're not wasting the milk and it's still there for you to be able to use so that's one so, trick i hope all of those things were helpful i'll try to link these products down below 
highly recommend these um Modella sells some but they only hold like two ounces and they're expensive as heck so I would recommend these they're durable you can reuse them you can clean them they're freaking amazing so I'll link these down below I'll also link the storage bags down below that's all for this video I hope this video was helpful please don't forget to subscribe please give this video a thumbs up and hit that bell notification button so you can be notified each time I upload until next time why do I keep saying that I'll see you guys later Bye. Whoosh.